Um, we're doing exercise number four for strength training with my daughter Elena, and today's is the row. So we're gonna work on the row, which is another very important movement. All of the exercises we've gone through are some of our foundational movement patterns. This one can be done in a couple different variations, but it's really important to build up strength in your posterior chain, which is the back of your body, especially the upper back. So think about posture, right? How many times are we on our phone, on our computer, right? You wanna stand up nice and tall, nice and straight. So we're gonna work on the row and I'm gonna show you two different variations. So the first one, Mom, I'm gonna have you grab the band here. So I want her to be far enough from the band. And the objective is, so we're gonna go micro bend in the knees, okay? And I want my mom to push her elbows back, almost like she's trying to press them into the wall behind her. And one of my favorite cues is thinking about pinching a pencil between the shoulder blades. So as she drives those elbows back, she's pinching that pencil between the shoulder blades. Good. And that is gonna help strengthen that upper back, which is really important for posture. Another variation of it, and this branches off of what we did last week with the hinge, is the bent over row. So with the bent over row, we're gonna get back in that hinge position. So pushing that bum back to the wall behind, soft bend in the knees. So we're gonna grab the dumbbells. I want you to do this way, okay? So we're hinging at the hips, push that bum back, let that chest fall forward. And then we're just gonna have those elbows. I want you to drive your elbows. No, that's, that's already up. Okay. So you're going to drive your elbows into the palms of my hand. Good. So what's really important is that you maintain that hinge position, but same thing, you're thinking about pinching that pencil between the shoulder blades and driving those elbows up and back. Beautiful. Okay. What I will say is if you're not super comfortable in that hinge position, a standing row with a resistance band or cable is a really good option. 